Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we will be going over Build a Suggestion Box app part 5. We'll be creating the reports and dashboards for our app. So, looks like we'll be creating two reports and a dashboard. So let's go ahead and jump into our trailhead org. So it looks like we already have our suggestions. Now we're in our Suggestion Box app. We're going to go to reports. And we're going to click new report. From here, we're going to go to our suggestion report type. All right, we're going to add a few new fields. Over here in the column section, we're going to add status and the number of days open. All right, so let's go ahead. We're going to add a filter and make sure that we're only going to add the ones that have been implemented. So we went here to filters and then we added a filter. We're going to go to implemented, click apply. And this one is good to go. So let's click save. Don't worry if you don't have any. Um, records in there. And we're going to put this in a public folder. Click save. and it should run. Oh, excuse me, we're gonna edit that actually. It needs to not be implemented since it's there, the new suggestions. So let's edit our filter here. Status is not equal to. There we go, we're in the save. And run. All right, we're going to copy this so you go save as suggestions by status. And we're going to keep it in the public reports. Save. And we're going to edit it so that it's all grouped up by status. And we're going to click save and run. Then we're going to add a chart. So from here, click add chart. And we're going to want this to be a donut chart. So I'm going to click here. Donut chart title is going to be suggestion status. And the value is going to be the record count. And we're going to go to somewhere to save this. All right, and then it should just be quick save right there. Next, we're going to add a dashboard. So let's go to the dashboards tab and click new dashboard. Yeah. 
the name is going to be suggestions dashboard and it's going to be in the default private dashboards so let's click component we want suggestions by status and select it we're going to want this to be a donut chart by record count so pretty much the same thing we just did and the title of this will be suggestions by status but without our little two dots there and add and then click save and done and there we go let's go ahead and check this out in our challenge so a few reasons you might not pass this is of course if you didn't edit all of the fields or the titles or whatnot and they weren't exactly correct All right, there we go. We have a shiny new badge on our profile. Thank you for joining me for the Build a Suggestion Box app. This is a really great one if that you could actually implement in your business if you wanted to have people add suggestions for the office. Great HR tool. Um, be sure to like and subscribe to this video. It really helps out my channel and helps me create more helpful videos like this. I'll catch you guys in the next one.